Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome to Path to Wellness. Today's video is a fruit-based diet plus intermittent fasting, what I'm going to eat today. So I figured I'd start off today's video by making this smoothie right here on camera and just talking about it a little bit. I've made smoothies similar to this in the past. This is one of my favorite ones. And right now it's about 1 p.m. And I'm about to make, this is gonna be my first meal today. I did about a four mile run uh, yesterday I did strength training, tomorrow I'll do strength training, so I'm kind of switching up between strength training and running. But now I'm ready to eat, so throughout the morning I just had water, had about two liters of water, and I'm going to get going here with this smoothie. So this is one of my favorite smoothies. Normally I have frozen bananas, but I ran out and I didn't have a chance to freeze them, so I'll be using um, bananas that are not frozen today. If you've seen my other videos, I usually freeze my bananas. But I'm going to start off with some coconut water. And I'm gonna put about a cup of coconut water in there. Next up is gonna be some almond milk. And I'll put about a cup of almond milk in there, a little less. So right now I've been fasting for about 18 hours. Um, yesterday I finished eating at 7 p.m. Now it's 1 p.m. About an 18 hour fast with a six hour eating window. That seems to work good for me. Sometimes it's a little less, sometimes it's a little more. I got frozen strawberries. So I'll put a cup of that. I got frozen blueberries. I'm gonna put a cup of that. Next up, I have chia seeds. I like soaked chia seeds. They're supposed to be really good for digestion, good source of omega-3 fats. So I just put a third a cup of chia seeds and a cup and a half of water. Throw that in the refrigerator, it lasts a couple of days. I usually use like three, four big tablespoons right there. I have some cacao powder for flavor. And I'm gonna use about a tablespoon of this. I have Daily Green Boost. This is very rich in nutrition. Check it out, uh, I think it's at dailygreenboost.com, you can get it. I'm gonna put about a tablespoon or so of Daily Green Boost, I'm almost out, I just ordered more. They, basically it's just barley grass juice powder and they, they uh, grow it in really good soil, so there's a lot of vitamins and minerals in that. And let's see, I got bananas, got five of them today. Again, uh, usually I use frozen bananas, but since I was out, we'll just use fresh ones. I like the texture a little better with the frozen bananas. So let me know what, what kind of smoothies do you guys like to make? Does anyone like smoothies out there? It's a good way to break the fast. It's a lot of nutrition, good workout recovery. There's the carbs, the protein, the fat, everything in here. Um, good amount of calories. If you're working hard like me, you need those calories, so I don't skimp on that. This thing's definitely over a thousand calories. And you can always cut this recipe in half if this is too much. And then uh, lastly, I'm gonna put some peanut butter in here. This is just peanuts and just a little bit of salt. And that's it, just two ingredients. So I'll put about, I don't know, a few tablespoons in there. And that's it. So we'll go ahead and blend this up and uh, we'll take a look how much this made. Okay, I decided to add some frozen peaches too. I forgot that I still had peaches. So, I'm gonna put about a cup of frozen peaches in there and finish blending that up. And there it is, made about a liter and a half. So I'll enjoy this, sip this kind of slowly, chew it while, you know, because it's good for digestion. Chew your smoothies and get back to work and I'll be back soon with my next meal today.